Hey guys, Ben the Medic here. Welcome to the channel. Now today I'm over here at this place called Shang Hot Pot in Brooklyn, right? Now this is the pricing structure. For this place, you have to pay separately for the soup. That's $18.99 for one flavor, $19.99 for two flavors, and three flavor pot is $21.99. Right? As you can see here on the bottom, the hot pot buffet price is $28.99. Now they call this a buffet, but I don't see any place for you to actually get stuff from except for the sauce bar, the all you can drink refrigerator, this thing here where you get like a dough stick, and then this hair thing that I actually do not know what it is. Alright, so for $28.99, it is some sort of limited menu, and then for $45.99, it is an uh, expanded menu. Now, looking from the outside, the place don't look so great. But then once you get inside, the seating area is actually quite nice. You know, actually a very like well decorated. You know, it's pretty good, right? And now we're gonna eat some of this stuff and see how it is. Alright. Muscles guys. All right, now I'm also going to add some of this to my pot. Now the chopsticks here are actually quite long as you can see. It's about as long as... Uh, so today I will not be drinking tap water because the drinks are included. So I got here Diet Coke and rare soybean drink. It's rare guys. Like you don't see this often. All right, so some of this beef is done. Let's give it a try. It's very really spicy, guys. Woo. I'm gonna feel this tomorrow. And so, I think the muscle is ready. Let's take a look at that. very fresh. I like it. Um, 8.5 for the beef and 8.5 for the muscle. Actually it's pretty darn good. So now I'm gonna try some of this beef over here. All right now we're gonna try the second type of beef. To tell you the truth, it looks a lot like the first type of beef. Here we go. It kind of tastes almost the same, but a little bit gamey. Like, like, it's just not lamb, is it? Lamb. All right, well, Tung didn't order lamb, but it kind of got that little bit of lamb flavor to it. All right, moving along. Now we're going to try uh, this stuff here. Wow, I like it. Thick, fat sheets. And I'm going to throw in some of these mushrooms over here.
Hi, I'm try some of this tofu skin thing. It tastes like noodles. I like it. Give it a seven and a half. Hmm. All right. And now the mushrooms has been in there for a little while, so let's give that a try. All right. Hmm. Eight. Eight for the mushrooms. Now, I really don't need to tell you how any of this tastes. It all tastes like that really spicy broth. I mean, like, that's the way it's meant to be. Ooh, it's spicy. Now it's time to give this beef a try. And now that beef is ready, let's take a closer look. Like a seven. To be honest, I enjoy the first beef best. And the first one was called the snowflake beef. Snowflakes, guys. All right, guys. So I had a bunch of stuff, and you know, I'll think about it and I'll give you my final thoughts back at the apartment. All right, guys, so this is what I think of the Shang hot pot in Brooklyn. All right, now, you have to understand this. I've never been there before in my life, right? Now, it was recommended by Tung. And you know Tung, he likes what he likes, right? So then I was like, hey, Tung, are you sure you want to go? He's like, yeah, 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 let's go, right? Now, had I have known like the pricing structure and all that stuff ahead of time, I would have been like, pay for soup? There's no way I'll pay for soup. I'd rather go to 99 Favor and get the soup for free, right? But Tang didn't tell me that. So I ended up going and then, you know, I was already there. So uh, yeah, he tricked me. All right, now that being said, I actually liked it, okay? Now, I'm gonna have to tell you, there's a, a few things you need to know about that place that I had no idea. Tung didn't tell me. I had to ask the waitress and the manager to get all this information, all right? Now, I will be going again, right? Because I liked it. Now, my friend Nelly over here, Nelly loves hot pot. Now, because I'm going to go there again with Nelly, right? I purchased their membership card, right? The membership card, you give them $100. Right, then you get a card. Right? On that card is hundred dollars for the future. Right? Now I asked them, does it expire? They say no. That's a terrific, right? Now, uh, that hundred dollar card, right, makes you a member. Right? If you notice earlier uh, when I showed you the little pricing scheme, as a member, you get a couple of bucks off. So that's pretty good, right? No brainer. I, I, I liked it enough that I will be back. I'm gonna bring Nelly. Might as well get a couple of bucks off to this time and a couple of bucks off next time. And each time you go again and again, right? Now, that being said, right? Bring cash, guys, bring cash. Because if you pay with cash, they'll give you this here watermelon juice, right? It is actually, I, I know the picture is not full full, but when I got it, it was full. Full to the top watermelon juice, like real watermelon squished, right? Now that is worth something. You just gotta pay with cash, right? And also, 
if you are going to buy the hundred dollar membership card bring an extra hundred bucks in cash for that as well okay now when you go right this time i went tongue went and got the 40 something dollar meal because he likes that certain stuff that it comes with i myself you know i'm a more basic guy i like the usual stuff so the 28.99 thing would have been good enough for me but they 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 say that you know when you go everyone on the table got to get the same thing right but at the same time they said that if you go alone you are you are allowed to dine alone so i should have just made tongue get get to a different table and then let me have my 28.99 but then i gotta pay for the soup you know yeah we all gotta pay for the soup right no matter how many people sit at the table you have to purchase the soup in the middle now when buying the soup in the middle right i've asked them what's the two most popular ones right and they said the spicy like how spicy right that one comes with a teddy bear guys it comes with a teddy bear that melts in your pot so that house special soup and the coconut chicken soup right that comes with coconuts where they empty it out and they just guys guys i'm talking about coconuts that coconuts guys right they pour it, the coconut into your thing like like they just like chop it from the tree i don't know where they got the coconut but it's actual coconuts so that's really great all right now that being said when you order the regular stuff right which of course it would be a few bucks off if you're a member for 25 and change right make sure you ask them for the long thing of beef tongue didn't know about it so we missed out the next table got it and i was like oh my god can i please take a picture of your long thing of beef right so super long the waitress told me that it is eight orders of beef right now uh, next time i go i will be getting that that's the long thing of beef and i'll get it with their uh you know usual house special beef or whatever they call it the standard one that comes in coils you know what i mean yeah so that's it i liked it i give it a 8.5 overall experience and i i'm i'm happy enough i will be back even if i have to pay for the soup you know because like you know the drinks are included if you if you don't get the 40 something dollar version and you go for the uh 20 something dollar version much better well worth it all right thanks for watching guys have a good one. Oh, and they said there's parking uh so i went around and i looked i'm guessing that's the parking i'm not sure ask them if you drive i don't know uh, i mean it seems a little you know but maybe i got the wrong place but the lady said there is free parking all right have a good one guys